Hi guys, uh, today I just received my package, Amazon package, which contains the Pilot Metropolitan. I'll be giving you an overview of the aesthetics of the pen, and later on we'll get into the writing part. So as you can see, it's just a simple cardboard box, but what with the Pilot branding of course on it. And here's the uh, cost of the pen. The pen costs you about 1400 bucks if you order it from Luxor. The distributors of uh, pilot pens in India sorry and uh, otherwise on Amazon I got this one for about 918 rupees so here comes out the case ok so this case is it's, actually it's pretty good it's uh, mostly plastic a very nice uh, pilot logo on it plastic case you can you just slide it out um, Side. I I actually ordered the Python edition of the pen. So here it is. Yeah. So just take it out from the plastic. All right. So here we have the pen. Um, I must say it's a heavy pen compared to my Parker Frontier. Quite heavy. And. Uh, as you can see, it's made of stainless steel. Then it's a single piece barrel. As you can see, very uh, the blonding. Yeah, I don't think the camera can focus. Yeah, Japan, if you can see. And here you have Pilot. Alright. This is a very clean pen. Just the Python uh, uh, pen here as well. And you have the Python finished sort of coating here same texture pattern whatever you call it okay let's open it up and here's the color nib it is a medium nib it says pirate japan the grip section is quite smooth um, thinner at the end We have the squeeze converter with the pilot branding on it, of course. And this is the oh wow, the feed I almost forgot. The feed has these uh, slit sort of it's just a design, not really a slit. And uh, medium nib, little design on the nib as well. Okay, coming back to the converter, the converter is a squeeze type converter. One of the drawbacks of this converter, I believe, is uh, that you can't see the ink level once you fill it, and of course, you won't be able to fill the ink, uh, you know, all in one go. So you'll have to repeat the steps. And let's see how it fares once we try filling. So this is how you squeeze it. Okay. So that's pretty much it. The next follow up would be with the writing test let's see how it writes because this happens to be one of the favorite fountain pens under the price bracket of say 2000 bucks 2000 indian rupees that is in india and uh, i already used one uh, parker frontier pair so let's see how it stacks up against the parker frontier which costs about half of it half of the price of a uh, pirate uh, metropolitan Alright guys, thanks for watching and now I'll see you in the writing test. Bye. Okay, so I just filled my Pilot Metropolitan with Camden Blue Ink. This one, pretty cheap, 20 bucks. And uh, let's see how it writes. Oops, I forgot to make my fingers nonetheless. Okay, so the first feel is it's actually heavy when I compare it, compare it to with my Park uh, Frontier. I'll give you a comparison. Let's keep it aside for the time being. Let's write something. Um, okay. So, um, Pilot. Wow, it's very smooth. Pilot. 
个套子。Comes with the medium net. There is a far, like the first thing you notice, it's is it spins quite heavy, and the second is it's very smooth. Like this is the first time I'm writing with it, and it's very smooth. Okay, now for comparison, I'll just use my Arca Frontier. Well, this pen I've been using for about two and a half years, so as you can see, this has become. Quite lose the cap spin sort of, and that's why I thought it would be a good idea to change my pen after all these years. Okay, so let's write with it. Mind you, this also has a medium nib, but the pilot Japanese nibs are usually they write thinner when compared to the European nibs. So I'll give you an example comparison. This is the Parker Frontier comes with a medium nib as well yeah so as you can see the Parker Frontier writes broader when compared to the Pilot Metropolitan the reason being as I mentioned the Japanese like to make the nibs a bit thinner when compared to the European nibs so let's do a little sentence writing with it Oops. okay the famous sentence the quick Brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Okay, it's pretty thin, and uh, for people who have small handwriting like me, you can actually see the difference. Um, the O in this case is like all uh, filled in with ink, however, in this case, you can actually see how clear O is. So people with small handwriting like me can opt for the Pilot Metropolitan. It's more like a, the name is more on the finer side. So let's do some um, little little line variation there. Maybe I'll, yeah, not able to. Okay, not a pro at it. Forgive me for this. But anyway, um, it's pretty smooth as you can see. Um, yeah, everything else. So down. How about writing it on the opposite side? Okay, we can't write it this way. Of course, we can't. Uh, Being flow is not that great. Anyway, we won't be using your fountain pen like this. So. so Thanks for watching. I hope you liked the video. Thank you.